All right, Championship Wrestling from Hollywood fans. Everyone here is so excited for September 26th, the big Championship Wrestling from Hollywood house show in Pomona, California. Now, you're going to see things that you're not going to see televised on television, so the only way to experience is to be there live. Uh, hold, and hold on a second. You're, you're telling me that there's a house show in Pomona on the 26th, information on the bottom of the screen, and no one told me about it till now? Are you misusing me? The people want to see me. That's why they come out to these shows, to see me. This Stu. is crazy. How do you not put me on that show? Stu, you're going to be at the show. I'm booked? Yeah, yeah. We, of course. We want Stu Stone there. Oh. Well, uh, this is going to be one of the greatest nights ever. I just might have to come. I just might have to take them up on their offer and kick some ass in Pomona. Stu Stone's going to be there. Might. Might. Welcome everyone to Championship Wrestling from Hollywood. I'm Todd Kennelly along with Stu Stone. And Pierce said it, if you're gonna dance with the devil, you gotta walk through the flames. O'Shea has done that, but tonight he faces Pierce inside the steel cage. He does, you know, these people love me, they do. But you know what they really love? It's blood, it's violence, and it's the destruction that our main event is gonna bring tonight. Steel cage match. Mikey O'Shea is gonna be locked in a cage with the scrap daddy. Adam Pierce, it's gonna be explosive time. Everyone here at Championship Wrestling cannot wait for the next big, wait, Stu Stone, what are, you, what are you doing here? Are you going somewhere? Hey, I'm going on a trip, all right? I'm not at the broadcast table, no. You can see that. You think I've traveled around this world and collected all of these air miles for nothing, Grant? Answer me. Uh, no. No, I have not. I'm ready to cash in those air miles and I gotta fly around the world one more time. Because the Family Stone is going through some dark days right now. Yeah, yeah, you've seen it. Othello, you can't miss him. He's a big, ugly, eyesight, eyesore building that needs to be taken down. And obviously, I can't do it by myself. I'm five foot seven. I'm a Jew from Canada. I can't beat Othello. And I know that. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to travel the world and find the man that can. You guys will miss me. But when I'm back... Family Stone is back. Call me a cab. <laughs> Tonight, in a steel cage, it's gonna be the giant Othello and James Morgan finally ending it all. But it's not just a steel cage, Grant, because I'm a crazy man. And I'm so crazy that I came up with a crazy idea, and that's to invite the people to come on down to the Ocean View Pavilion and bring the weapons. Now, we have a lot of crazy viewers, Grant. You know that worldwide. A lot of crazy, kooky people watch this show. God knows what kind of weapons they're gonna bring. Well, I saw the fans lined up outside. There's weapons all over the they place. They could bring a crossbow. A crossbow? They could bring some frozen shrimp. Some fro a frozen shrimp? A, a whole bag of them. They could go to Costco and buy a whole, what do you call those? A pallet? A whole pallet of frozen shrimp. But you know what? I don't need to go to Costco because I know how to beat Othello and end the war. I don't need a super mega store. All I needed was my Uncle Sheldon's garage sale. And I got the book right here. This is the book on how to beat Othello. This book is going to tell you how to beat Othello? It sure is. W what does it say? This is Stone's notes right here, and if you turn to page 420, it says right here, the only weapon you need to beat Othello is the heavy hitter, James Morgan. Ladies and gentlemen, finally, we are live, 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 live. All right. And tonight, when all is said and done, when the war is over, somebody in this ring is gonna be dead, 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 dead. <laughs> 